we have reached the end. I was starting to begin to think perhaps we would never would. And yeah, this is great. Now I think we are in the labyrinth, which has no map. Except for the one that James draws as he goes along. So with that in mind, you must keep your flashlight on to draw your map. If you don't keep the flashlight on, James can't draw his map. And if James can't draw his map, well, you don't know where you're going. Speaking of which, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, shit. We're about to hit the bad parts in the game. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the I'm gonna murder you violently part of the game, and uh, we should be going northeast. Good, northeast, awesome. At least we have a compass still or something. And kick him, yay! Oh my God, how many of you assholes are there in this place? Aren't you guys supposed to be in the hospital or something? How many hangman bolts I have left? 143. All right, I have no worries then. <laughs> I can waste all of them that I want. And let's go down the ladder. Yeah. Um, a little bit of warning here if you're going to be playing along with me. Pyramid head. Pyramid head's in here somewhere. So watch out for that. Okay. Watch out for pyramid head. He's a bad guy. And why is he toiling and roaming this area? Well, I believe that would be your answer right there. That's his great knife. This is where Pyramid Head stays, apparently. With his bloody tools that James doesn't want to think about. I'm pretty sure I know what they're for. And a bunch of cages and bed frames that he makes cages out of, I'm assuming. Let's check our map. Okay. Alright. Now we need to be very careful still. I'm not freaking kidding. Pyramid Head. Pyramid Head is in this very narrow, I can't see where I'm going hallway. Because this game hates us. Whew. Okay, we got out without Pyramid Head. Cool. And we should be right here. Awesome. Awesome to the max. Okay, then, um, I'm sorry if I'm, uh, I'm going to have to be cutting out large sections of me checking where the hell I'm supposed to be going, because this place is a labyrinth, as I said, and I cannot remember exactly the directions to go. I have a vague idea, but that's about it. Run past these guys. They're going to try and spit on us, but that's okay. And now we should be, unless I screwed up, in this room. Yes, awesome. There's a giant... Okay, whoa, camera. What the hell? Alright. There's a box here with faces on it. Okay, that's cool. And we have a room here with doorways everywhere. Yeah. So... I can't, like, enter first-person view or anything, can I? Of course I can't. Well, what we want to do is try and find a place where doors are on opposite sides, but still... Um, crap. Okay, we have two possibilities then. That one, that one there, or this one here. So we'll try... Oops, 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 oops. We'll try that one there. To get that to go there, I need to... Oh, crap. Turn the face... <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> turn the face to the left and up, I believe. Let's, t let's try it out. Yeah, the this face here, it controls that room. Okay, that was wrong then. 
Whoopsie, that's not right. Let's try that, perhaps? No. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, wow. Okay, I accidentally stumbled upon the answer. That's great. <laughs> Alright, here, I'll show you. If you're on normal difficulty, I believe this will always be the answer, you want this. Wait a minute. Yeah. You want the green face to be facing towards you and upside down. And that's your solution. And we go down yet again. <laughs>